that when you play these triplets, it's, it's pretty difficult at about 80% of this speed. I'm, let me see if... It's going to be a one, two, three, four. Okay, so when you... You have to bring it up very quickly and strum that triplet. That is very difficult. So I don't want you thinking that that's, uh, you know, something that a beginner should be able to do. Okay, um, most of the time in this song, 99% of the time, you're just going to be strumming. And the important thing for this is to work through the song, uh, playing it with uh, accents on the strums, like one and two and three. Add that triplet in there. That's that takes a lot of a lot a lot of practice to really sit there and work on that unless you just feel that naturally, which most people don't. See how the, the those triplets are smaller strums than we're not going. I mean that's that's just ridiculous. So it's a smaller strum and, and you make it light. Okay, like that. So most important thing is uh, just work on timing here. Okay, don't work on triplet strums and all that stuff. That's that's uh, just extra icing on the cake. Here we go. Loving you isn't the right thing to do. Can I have a chance?
to this angle so you can see. My wrist is, okay, okay. and those to embellish those chords and make it kind of cool. because that's the third note in the major scale for G and C. Okay, that's the third. Okay, and you're pulling that off on off beats. One and two and three and four and one and two and three. And putting it back on on, on an off beat. So it's a little bit tricky. So I'd say go slow. One and two and three and four and I went to that D on an offbeat. Let me let me play it just the way I want you to play it. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one two and three and four and one and 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 G7 for you. That's an extra little uh, bonus uh, lesson you get. G7, okay? Flatted seventh right there, folks. Amazing. Okay, now have fun with that, and uh, let me know if you have any problems.